And I, I hope that there's an opportunity for us to even go into other villages uh, with the opportunity and pull other villages in. I was at uh, a World Vision meeting today in Chicago. They have a big uh, warehouse in the city. And we uh, talked about the potential of having an affiliated warehouse here in Moni that could provide all kinds of goods and services uh, to the people in the area. And that would uh, also be an incredible highlight, I think, to Moni and World Vision here. So anyhow, uh, I can't say enough again, Blue and David Holston and uh, all that they've done and been a part, especially Jan, it's just been amazing. David, he's been a big help. And, um, Officer Mike, uh, just bless the young people Saturday morning. Uh, we had a ton of young people that just volunteered, and he said to them, you know, you, how many want, really want to be here? You want to volunteer and do something today? And, and, you know, the kids raised their hand, and he just, he affirmed them and said, you know, you just kind of renewed my faith in your generation. And I'll tell you, that really, that really blessed them in a big way. Were you talking to Scott just now? He's talking about uh, Trollman Drum. Oh, Trollman Drum. Very good. Yeah. You're way ahead so, of me. Yeah. <laughs> so we, we appreciate uh, all the support, and we just uh, believe that uh, it's just going to continue to have repercussions. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I tried to put a feather in my cap whatsoever, but uh, I got to uh, be interviewed at Comcast today. Get up at 5:30 in the morning to catch a train and go back to the good old loop that I spent about 40 years in working. And I did an interview with him, and the reason I did the interview, they invited me. They invited other mayors, and I was allowed to pick the subject. I was allowed to pick the subject. Thank you, Betty. Get my mouth closed. And uh, that's one of the main reasons I went because I didn't want to be blindsided with something that I don't know enough about to speak on. I told you all before. I'm not the smartest guy in the world. I'm smart enough to be surrounded by great people who know how to do their jobs, and I trust them. Anyway, I talked about Love Moni and uh, economic development, how we're moving here right now in Will County, and we hope uh, we can do some retail. Or I'm not saying we will at all, okay? That's one of our goals, though, and uh, we've got a lot to do before we can even do that. But uh, End the comments. Thank you very much, David. You guys did a tremendous job. Period. Okay, moving on, uh, I just want to mention to the trustees that uh, we do have a board meeting in November. I'm kind of blindsided on this one, but it's not a big deal. It's uh, the day before Thanksgiving. Is that a problem for anyone in November? Yes. Are you going to be out of town or anything? Yes, it is. Good, we'll definitely have the meeting then, though. Good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've, done, we've done one meeting in November, one in December. In the past seven years, I've been doing this. Okay. Right in the middle of the month. Correct. Okay. All right, if you're agreeing with that, we will uh, cancel the 23rd meeting. And do we want to move uh, the, uh, what would that be, the 8th, is it, or what's that date? I believe. Yeah, we'll see. Do you want to move that to the 15th? Okay, would you like to do in the middle of the month? Mr. Mayor, I believe yes, that there's several things at the end of the year that we have to take care of business-wise. It might be a little early to move that. I think we can agree in concept that we don't need to have that meeting. And then when we get closer, see how much business we have. So we will to have the two meetings. We can always call special meetings. Um, the problem, um, if we move, what well, we did in the last we, we didn't even have a meeting last year. We just, as Bill said, we had one meeting. Yeah. Um, well, that's what I'm asking. If you just want to have one day. Yeah, I just think it's too early now to make that make that call. We don't know what okay. to come up to. We'll mention it in October. I mean, we, we've served notice that we're not going to have that meeting, so that's good. Yeah, and it's, then it's we'll just a matter of need, you know, need basis. We okay. have the one, we have the one, we have the one in November, one, one in December. If it's absolutely necessary, it's active. And then yeah. definitely do it, because that's what we're here for. But yeah. My, yeah, my response to my response that, uh, Trustee Gray, so we really are a lot busier than before, but I don't mind if we fit it in, made it more appropriate to me. Wait until we're a little closer to it make that decision. So uh, I'll table that for now and talk about it. I'll get it on October's agenda. Well, that's the end of my report. Uh, we'll move on to the administrator's uh, report. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Um, item H1 on the agenda is the uh, Amazon water main easement. And uh, basically, there was additional water main required for the Amazon uh, building. 
and um, they put that water main in at their expense and uh, obviously we need to have an easement in order to service that water main. So the uh, uh, request is that the uh, motion authorizing the mayor and the clerk to sign that plat of easement would be in order. Any discussion there? Did this need to go to the zoning committee? No, sir. I'll make the motion. I'll second. second to the motion. I'll second. Any other discussion? Roll call, please. Trustee Holston? Yes. Trustee Horn? Yes. Trustee Racer? Yes. Trustee Vincent? Yes. Trustee Blue? Yes. Trustee Gray? Yes. One last item. Uh, it's not on the agenda, but uh, Superintendent Grizel and myself uh, had a meeting this afternoon with uh, Aqua, Illinois. And uh, basically, we were on a fact-finding mission and gathering some information uh, from them. Uh, we will be putting that together and forwarding it to the trustees individually for further discussion at, uh, at uh, future board meetings. Mr. Mayor, that concludes my report. Thank you very much. We'll move to uh, officials' report. On the works. Just two real quick Those things. things right? uh, Jim's a trailer, we're not going to go on that again. It's moving along nicely. Um, but two, I also want to give a, a pat on the back to Public Works. Uh, last Thursday night after our uh, meeting of the whole, uh, we had a water main break, and it was a water main break that I don't think anybody in this town has seen before. It literally was shooting from the Residents front yard over their house in the backyard. Uh, it was they thought it was rain because it wasn't raining and it wasn't. Uh, and they went out there. They they did their work. Uh, we did get the uh, messages from our administrator. A few hours there, and then again that one's going to go down in history in this town of, of the the work that they had to do. So I just want to throw out a pat on the back our public works uh, for doing something that they probably never seen before. Uh, superintendent can pass that on there, gentlemen. I appreciate it. And report. Thank you, uh, Trustee Gray. Yeah, they never know when to call. Me, so. right. They always respond. Oh, we'll move on to Parks and Recs. Trustee Vincent. Um, the next concert in the park will be this Sunday at Fireman's Park, 3 p.m. to 4.30. It's the 144th Illinois Army National Guard Brass Band. <coughs> Also, don't forget to mark your calendars because Fall Fest is coming September 8th, 9th, and 10th. And anyway. Sorry, Mary Jo, what time is that? Uh, 3 o'clock to 4.30. Thank you very much. Okay, we'll move on to Finance. Trustee Polsky. Finance Committee met today um, to review the AP warrants that we just uh, passed. We didn't have any issues with that. We also reviewed credit card charges for the last month that we had discussed and agreed we would do had no issues with that. And uh, had general discussion, nothing else came up in the report. Thank you very much. Uh, economic development, trustee group. No report. No report. I cannot believe thank you, Janet. She's a very busy woman, trust me. That's just a tease. No. Uh, building services. No report tonight, Mr. Mayor. Okay. Uh, thank you very much. Public safety, Anthony. Please. Um, yes, I have a couple things. A recent armed robbery on Sunrise Court has the Moni Police Department officers working extremely hard following many leads. We do feel that this is an isolated incident. There is no evidence that Moni residents should be more concerned than normal. Patrol units continue to be diligent. And as always, Lock up at bedtime and call the Moni Police Department with any suspicious activity. End of report. Thank you very much, Trustee Grayzak. Move on to the attorney's uh, report. Uh, Larry. Thank you, Mayor. I got three ordinances for the board to review and consideration. The, the first ordinance is the ordinance establishing salaries for the exempt employees for the fiscal year. Uh, this was uh, drafted pursuant to the board's directive at the last board meeting. Any discussion on this ordinance? We did go over it pretty heavily in executive session. If not, could I have a motion to approve the ordinance? I've got a motion to Second. Okay. Any discussion? If not, roll call. Trustee Warren? Yes. Trustee Racing? 
Yes. Trustee Benson? Yes. Trustee Blue? Yes. Trustee Gray? Yes. Trustee Holston? No. It is 1809. Thank you, Mayor. The next ordinance is an ordinance establishing voting by audio video methods. This is allowed pursuant to state law. Uh, the trustee, if he or she is unavailable, subject to certain conditions, he or she can attend uh, via audio or uh, video. Uh, but in order to got to be on the books, establishing the methods, and that's what the ordinance sets for. Any discussion on this ordinance? I have some discussion. We have done this in previously. Is, do we need to do this every year? Uh, no, sir. As long as the ordinance is passed tonight, establishing what methods will be used in the future, you can amend it in the future if the board deems appropriate. I think the biggest change, not change, but uh, we are asking for advance notice from the trustees so the clerk can adjust the record accordingly and there's limited situations when you can do it but if you want to amend it in the future you can so i don't believe we did this as a uh, uh, i think we did this one voice vote the last time it was not done by this method right yes, yes sir this this establishes a more formal way of doing it um, i've been involved in situations where north is on file it's safe that way and again, state law indicates you should have something of this nature. This is the third one I've been doing for this year, not in this for other places. So I think it's imperative that time. Yeah, when, we, uh, when I attended the IML meeting last fall, that was one of the things that was discussed. If you needed an ordinance or something official, which we did not have. So we did discuss it last fall. And, it did. and uh, just, to, just for the public's uh, interest in clarification, this is only for work or illness related absences it's not for vacation is that correct correct yes sir. okay <coughs> make a motion second here okay can we read that second we'll call please trustee racer yes trustee benson yes trustee blue yes trustee gray yes trustee holston yes trustee horn yes 1810. <clears throat> Thank you, Mayor. And the last item is an ordinance amending ordinance number 1766. This dealt with a early retirement incentive that we adopted last year for uh, a non contractual employee. There was a date that was incorrect and should have been reflected December 31st, 2017 as a I'm sorry, 16 is retirement date. Uh, the other changes uh, just basically pertains to the date and uh, financially the terms are the same. Just so the public knows, this ordinance had to do with the retirement of our, our former police chief. It's a mistaken And we're rectifying that. Do you have a discussion? What was the date on that you said, Larry? Uh, that was supposed to be? It's supposed to be December 31st, 2016. The ordinance called August 31st, 2017. Okay, so I must have the old one. Is that have it? Uh, oh, I'm seeing I'm just seeing it now. Okay, I see how it works. All right, very good. Uh, more of the discussion, and I'll make a motion. Okay, Jeff Blue. Blue call, please. Trustee Blue. Trustee Gray? Yes. Trustee Holston? Yes. Trustee Horn? Yes. Trustee Racer? Yes. Trustee Vincent? Yes. Number please. 1811. Thank you. That's all I have here. Okay. I'm to, uh, I know we're speeding this along, but not on purpose, okay? I thank you all. We're trying to keep you informed on what's going on. Uh, Old business, is there any other old business? Or any at all, I should say. If none, I'll move to new business. Oh my, slide out. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Open to the public, non agenda volumes, items. Anybody wish to come up to the mic, please do. Oh my. 
nothing for executive session. This must be a record. I'm almost proud of it because we're doing a great job, I think, and I think the public understands what we're doing. I need a motion to adjourn. I'll make that motion. I'll second. Any discussion? Roll call. Yes. Trustee Blue? Yes. Trustee Gray? Yes. Trustee Holston? Yes. 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 Trustee Horn? Yes. Trustee Racist? Yes. Trustee Vincent? Our meeting is adjourned. Thank you all for coming. Thank you.